So do you have a fixed mindset or a growth mindset? Or maybe you have both. Stay tuned. We hear a lot about fixed mindset and growth mindset, especially in the corporate world. And sometimes you have to pick one. Are you a fixed mindset or do you have a growth mindset? But you know what? I'm going to share with you a story where I think I have both, okay? When I am speaking, they have to give an introduction of me. So in front of all the audiences, someone gets up there and they sing my praises. Sometimes they sing them too loud. Sometimes if the introducer knows me, they may go off and start telling the audience how great I am. And I am standing there and I get fearful because you know what? I was going to try something new. I was going to try an exciting new opener. And now I'm afraid to do something new because what if it flops? What if I'm not great? That's a fixed mindset. People say you're great, but you're afraid to take a risk because you want to stay great. And so I have to tell you, many times I have that fixed mindset. When people introduce me to other people and they sing my praises, I get nervous. Like, can I live up to all of that? But I also have a growth mindset. And that growth mindset started a long time ago. I went to Ohio State University and I was in a grad program with Dr. Costi. This course, everybody wanted to be with Dr. Costi because it was about exploring your creative mind. I took the course. I thought I did great. And at the very, very end of the semester, Dr. Costi called me in and she said, Karen, I want to talk to you about your creative mind. She said, I don't think you're that creative. She said, you're resourceful. And she started going on and on telling me all the benefits of being resourceful. But in my mind, all I could think of was, I'm not creative. I'm not creative. Now, if you know me, you know that that happened a long time ago, and I'm still talking about it. You know, I think about what Dr. Costi said all the time, and I want to go, yes, but I broke through, right? I persevered. I pushed my creativity, and I have a growth mindset. So why am I telling you this? I'm telling you this because it's not etched in stone what we are. I want you just to begin to be aware of mindsets, to see when you have a fixed mindset, and to notice when you're moving more into a growth mindset. Because I believe, I believe that if we explore, if we continue to grow, we're going to have a much more successful and happier life. Hey guys, this is Karen McCullough, and I hope I check in on you and your mindsets with another lesson from the road.